Hello! I'm going to quickly show you how to stop the vanilla walking animations and various other vanilla animations that can interfere with your own animations. So here I have set it up so that the arm moves throughout the few frames that I have here, moving up and down, but the vanilla animations are still playing, the legs are still moving. And in order to prevent this, I need to set the animation to be non-additive, so these changes made to the right arm, for instance, will overwrite the vanilla animations. And then upon changing it to non-additive, we fix the additive. The arm is not correctly in position, but we just move that, and then there we have it. We'll just have to move, move it into the correct position for every single frame. And there we go. The vanilla animation no longer plays. And say, what if I don't want to change the position of the arm or leg whatsoever? In that case, I would just set one of the rotations that are on 0 to 360, since that is basically 0, but it recognizes that it's been changed. So the non additive animation will overwrite the vanilla animation. And in another case, where I don't want the non-additive to overwrite a vanilla animation, for instance, the player's head rotating as they look around, non-additive will overwrite the head looking around animation. So in this case, what I want to do with this animation is duplicate it, set it to non-additive, fix that. Sometimes it'll do the fix additive doesn't work and in order to remedy this is simply reload the model and go back to the animation since it's just a visual issue and because this animation is additive the head will be able to look around still with the vanilla animation and because i have two running animations called body, I would, both of these animations will play at the same time because they have the same name for the same animation. And I want only the head to be additive. So what I do is I would clear all the animations for all the other body parts that are affected in the other animation. which would be everything here. And in the one that has non-additive, I would simply clear all the frames for the head. And that means the legs won't be affected by the vanilla animation in the non-additive animation. And the head would still move how it would in the additive animation. So here, real quick, I'm going to clear, in my additive animation, I'm going to leave the heads animation as is, and I'm going to clear everything for, well, everything that is affected in the, the non-additive animation. Here we go, so now this animation only affects the head, and in my non-additive animation, the head is not being affected. So this animation overwrites the leg, so it doesn't play the vanilla animation on this arm leg, and the head should still be able to look around. So I'll save and we'll test that real quick. And then if we start running, we can see that the head can still look around. Although my I do have a head tilt animation that also plays, but none of them overwrite each other. And as you can see, the front legs don't play the vanilla running animation anymore, as the non-additive animation has overwritten them. Thank you for watching, I hope this helped, and I'll see you in the next one. Bye now.